how to change your NATS, ATM withdrawals, and third-party fund transfer limits via Digibank mobile app. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimo from How to Geek. In today's guide video, I will simply show you the way on how you can change ATM withdrawals, your NATS, as well as third-party fund transfer limits. But before we get started, as always, if you are new to our channel, to make sure to leave a like and hit the subscribe button. Without any further ado or delay, let's get started with today's video. Now the number one step is to simply log into your Digibank mobile with your Touch ID, your Face ID or your Digibank user ID and PIN. Once you log into your account, you will see this kind of interface. Now open successful logging in, just tap on the more button which is located at the very bottom right hand side of the screen. Once you tap on the more button, right over here under the transfer settings, you have to scroll down and select the option that says ATM debit card limit. So just go ahead and select it. Once you select your ATM or debit card limit option, over here you have to simply select the option called ATM card limit. Keep in mind that you can also change the spending limit for your debit card, but you can simply select ATM card limit since in this video I'm going to show you that. Once you've done so, you can simply select your ATM card and indicate the limits that you wish to update. So just go ahead and select the ATM withdrawal limit that you want to as well as third party fund transfer limit, your NATS limit and you have to simply select your card as well. And once you've done, just tap on the next button which is at the very bottom right corner. And you have to review the details of the transaction and tap change daily limit now to complete the request. And this is simply how you can go ahead and change your NATS, ATM withdrawals and third party fund transfer limits for your DBS bank via Digibank Mobile. We hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have any more questions, queries or doubts, make sure to also leave them down. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon in our next video.